it's not getting to That's the because point. of Moss. No, it's because Israel no, is not allowed. No, it's because you've been brainwashed. Well, I've been brainwashed or you've been brainwashed? No, you have. Excuse me, Senator, there's going to be a historic vote today on weapons to Israel. How are you going to vote on that? Senator? Will you vote to stop supplying Israel? How are you going to vote on the joint resolution so the disapproval you, to, let, to stop you. offensive weapons to Israel? Senator, let's obey our own laws and stop sending weapons to Israel. I we know you care about this issue, and we know you know that we haven't been abiding by U.S. law. Thank you so much. Please, please vote to limit weapons to Israel. Senator Hirono, please, you're on the wrong side of history. You're a woman, just like us. Senator Rano, please. Please think about the children when the vote comes up today. Vote to stop these offensive weapons to Israel, please, Senator. Why not? Don't you think that they. Well, what do you think about the civilian casualties and the fact that they haven't been letting humanitarian aid in? Do you think that Israel is letting in the aid that it's. I know, but have you looked at U.S. What about U.S. law? I'm with the people that are sympathetic towards that. I'm not. But no, the law that says we can't give military assistance to a country that's stopping our humanitarian aid from getting in. Basically, they are defending themselves. I support this from defending itself. And I support this from wiping out the Hamas. Period. But well, what about the starvation of civilian population that's happened Hamas. in northern that's Gaza? What, that's what Hamas, Hamas is doing. No, it's Israel that's not letting no, the aid in. Do you think Israel is letting aid in? Oh, I know that the aid's getting in. It's just not getting to the people. We know that for a fact. Well, it's not getting to the That's people. That's because of Hamas. No, it's because Israel no, is not allowed. No, it's because you've been brainwashed. Well, I've been brainwashed or you've been brainwashed. I think That's you've right. been brainwashed. You think Israel can do no harm. So, no, 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 no more. We're done. We just disagree. Yeah. Yeah. But Jeff, what about all the children that have been killed every single day? Um, I, I respectfully that. disagree. We respectfully just disagree. I'm right. so sorry. Well, we're I, seeing babies getting killed I every respect, day. I really respect your position. But at what point are you going to turn around and say, wait a minute, that's too much? Senator, we're counting on you to vote the right way today. I know a lot of your constituents have been writing and calling and contacting you. And really want to make sure that you're thinking today about the children of Gaza and how we can get food to hungry people, how we can stop the killing and these offensive weapons. It's the first time in history that we actually get a chance to vote to stop sending offensive weapons to Israel. And we hope you'll be up for the moment and vote in favor of Bernie Sanders' resolutions. Too bad you don't look at me anymore, boy. Senator, have you had a chance to look at the joint resolutions of disapproval that Bernie said? Do you know how you're going to vote on that? Do you think it's a time to limit weapons to Israel? Have you looked at all the people who are starving? I'm asking you because it's urgent that people are starving and have power. Well, it would be nice if you showed some concern about all the people who are being killed.